Hi, my name's Trev Hutchings, and this is how to quickly clean up your song mix in BandLab using the Easy EQ. Your song can sound grey and muddy when the frequencies of the different tracks interfere with each other, but here is a quick and simple way to clean up your mix. Double tap the vocal track header image. Then tap on effects at the bottom of the screen. Tap on the plus icon. Then at the top of the FX screen, tap on the plus icon. Scroll through the tabs at the top of the FX screen and tap on the Tone tab. Then tap on Easy EQ. Drag the dot on the line to the right of the words High Pass to the right as much as possible without changing the important part of the sound. This will remove any unwanted low frequencies that could interfere with other tracks. Drag the dot on the line to the right of the words low pass to the left as much as possible without changing the important part of the sound. This will remove any unwanted high frequencies that could interfere with the other tracks. The other three dots combine to set a frequency range to either highlight a part of the sound or hide a part of the sound. Drag the dot on the line to the right of the word gain to the right to highlight the frequency range set by the dot on the line to the right of the word frequency. or to the left to hide the frequency range. Here, I will drag it to the right. Drag the dot on the line to the right of the word frequency, to the right to choose a higher frequency range. or to the left to choose a lower frequency range. Here I will drag the dot so it says 1619 Hz below the word frequency. Drag the dot on the line to the right of the word width to the right to increase how many frequencies above and below the frequency set by the dot on the line to the right of the word frequency that are highlighted or hidden. or drag the dot to the left to reduce them. Here I will drag the dot so it says 0 0.77 below the word width. Now add the EZQ equaliser 
to all the other tracks. If you enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.